and I have a small dog named Diane Keaton. I actually named my quilting business after her. It's called Keaton Quilts. That's after Diane Keaton. Uh, she's the love of my life. She just brings so much joy into every day. It's already a dream quilting, but being able to do that with my little girl next to me, it really is the best. I was 15 years old, I had gone into foster care and I had used crafting. Definitely it was therapeutic in the way that it helped me get me through a lot of hard times. And I had worked at a Joanne Fabrics and all of my friends there crafted and I really felt like the quilting community embraced me and definitely helped me get through a lot of hard times. I really love quilting specifically as a craft in the way that I definitely see it as art, but it's also something that you can get comfort so it can be beautiful. It can mean so much to someone. For example, a memory quilt made out of a loved one's clothing, being able to cuddle with that and have that with you, I think that's really beautiful. My name is Justin Stafford. I own a small quilting business. I had started making quilts with the idea that I would sell them on a website and people organically reached out and asked if I taught quilting. So I started teaching quilting lessons and that led to me writing my first book uh, that has 15 quilting patterns in it and uh, just tutorials on how to do it. And I'm now writing a second book and I have a fabric collection on the way and it's all really exciting. It's been amazing uh, being able to do something I love. So my grandmother was a big inspiration that got me started in quilting. Uh, but just even now, living in this beautiful city, I live in the East Village of New York, and it's very vibrant. There's just a juxtaposition of people and color and line, and so I definitely draw a lot of my inspiration from uh, the city and my surroundings. There's nothing like coming home and sitting and just clearing my mind, and there's so much hustle and bustle and running around that I feel like I'm able just to decompress from the stress of my day. The workbox has really been a game changer for me. Before the workbox, everything was kind of shoved in bins, I had drawers, and I could never find anything. Having everything just organized, I'm able to see it all. Uh, I remember I used to buy things that I already had because I couldn't find them. I would have to pull it all out because it was in a mess just to find something. So then when I finished quilting, I would put it all back in the same messy way. And it was just the cycle that I kept going through. As a quilter, everyone buys fabric over and over and builds up a stash over their lifetime. It, it's really fun and exciting, but at some point, you know, you're just covered in bins and you can't find anything and just then getting it organized and putting it away is such a chore with the workbox. I have all my fabric organized by color and so if I'm using color, I can pull out, you know, a drawer of the pinks and I can just throw them back in when I'm finished, put the drawer away, and you know, it looks nice and it's organized. Another thing is that I live in a small apartment in the city and it's really hard to stay organized in such a small space. And the fact that I can take all my quilting supplies and have them all in this workbox and at the end of the day then be able to close the workbox, I feel like it doesn't take over the whole space. And I, you know, I still have my apartment but I really have this beautiful workspace available to me when I want it. The original scrap box gave such great support. I remember I'd broken one of the pieces and they sent it right out to me, no questions asked, and I was able to fix it on my own. I love that the scrap box uses such simple tools. It came with all the tools I needed to put it together and it was just really handy and simple. It's just been such a game changer because I can open this up in the morning and I can lay out my stuff and I can find everything. There's no doubt in my mind that I get so much more done having everything nice and organized. It's amazing being able to quilt and do what I love for a living, but one of the best parts of that is being able to do my job and my work from home. And I get to spend my days with this little girl and she just brings so much joy to my life. Alright, she needs <laughs> a gotta, minute of adjustment. Trying to figure it out. You know. Oh, that's funny. Hey, sweetie. Nice girl.